The Malaysian Armed Forces Sentiasa Bersepadu The modern history of the Malaysian Armed Forces began with the enlistment of 25 Malay youths into the Royal Malay Regiment Probationary Squad on the 1st of March 1933. From a force that fought against the insurgency, the Malaysian Armed Forces has always upheld the objectives of the National Defence Policy and in tandem with the Defence White Paper through a number of transformational processes has valiantly developed into a modern, effective and versatile force dominating the whole military operations spectrum. The Malaysian Armed Forces is a military component under the Ministry of Defence led by the Chief of Defence Force as the principal military advisor to the Minister of Defence. The Chief of Defence Force holds full responsibility for the command and operations of the Malaysian Armed Forces. The Malaysian Armed Forces' primary role is to defend the country's sovereignty and national interests from any external threats. The Malaysian Armed Forces' secondary role includes assisting the nation's civil authorities in safeguarding state security to provide assistance during disasters, engaging in international-level humanitarian peace missions, as well as supporting world peace efforts under the United Nations. With the vision to become a fully credible military force and to fulfill its mission to protect the nation's sovereignty, integrity and interests, the Malaysian Armed Forces development is based on the integrated capability among all sister services, prioritizing on the concept of versatility and togetherness. The Malaysian Armed Forces capability development emphasizes on asset integration and intercorrelation among the three services in order to enable the forces to dominate all battlefield domains encompassing land, sea, air, information as well as multiple crisis spectrum or cyber spectrum. The Malaysian Armed Forces is consistent in their efforts towards capability development based on the 4th Dimension Armed Forces or 4D MAF policy that is refined dynamically and supported by a specially formulated development plan from all services in accordance to current and future requirements. The main command structure under the Malaysian Armed Forces are the Malaysian Armed Forces Headquarters, the Malaysian Army, the Royal Malaysian Navy, the Royal Malaysian Air Force, the Joint Force Headquarters. With the aim of becoming a credible and inclusive force, the Malaysian Army envisions to generate a force that is modern, credible, balanced and always prepared to defend Malaysia's land security and sovereignty and its national interests against any external threats. With the strength of 16 corps and regiments encompassed in the Army, the formation is divided into five divisions entrusted to the Western and Eastern Field Commands. The Army's 4 Next G transformational plan is a continuity of the Army 2 10 plus 10 plan and it is a plan which considers all aspects including geopolitics, threat spectrum, national policy and strength of the current fiscal. The plan is also in parallel with the land battle strategy which will enable the Army to efficiently and effectively operate in various operational environment domains. With the mission of protecting national maritime sovereignty and interests, the Royal Malaysian Navy is responsible for preparing and deploying its naval force at any time to ensure the safety of the national waters during peacetime and ensure victory during war. The operations of the Royal Malaysian Navy is entrusted to the Western Command Fleet Headquarters and Eastern Command Fleet Headquarters. The Royal Malaysian Navy is taking steps to become a world-class Navy through the introduction of the 15 to 5 Transformation Program, which is a transformative, creative and cost-effective step to increase its defence asset quality while enhancing its capability in ensuring that the national security and defence are always protected. The Royal Malaysian Air Force 
holds the vision of becoming a dominant air force with the mission of defending the country's sovereignty and integrity as well as its national interests through the effective use of air power. The main formation of the Royal Malaysian Air Force is the formidable and modern air combat squadrons based at main air bases throughout Malaysia. The squadrons are supported by elements of transportation, radar surveillance, air traffic control and ground-based air defence systems to secure its domination in the air. The operations of the air bases are entrusted to Air Region 1 and 2 headquarters. The Royal Malaysian Air Force has also introduced its development plan known as CAP-55. The plan emphasizes on optimum use of assets in tandem with current technological advances to enable the Air Force to achieve efficient operational results. Based upon the principle of developing, training and supervising entrusted to respective services, every personnel from each services will be equipped with the required skills and knowledge, beginning with the basics of military training to enable them to execute their core duties as well as performing joint operations together. In order to produce excellent workforce, the Malaysian Armed Forces are also focused towards the personnel's work-life balance and career development. The Malaysian Armed Forces expansion includes the developments of facilities and personnel's career advancements as these will create a professional and capable Malaysian Armed Forces generation who are able to withstand any challenges in defending the country. Apart from focusing on active service personnel, the Malaysian Armed Forces also looks into the welfare and services of its veterans whom have contributed their efforts and ideas in bringing the Malaysian Armed Forces to where it is today. The Malaysian Armed Forces also receives good support from the Government of Malaysia who is ever committed to ensure that the Malaysian Armed Forces is always at their utmost readiness. In conclusion, the Malaysian Armed Forces is fully focused towards perfecting their capability of defending the nation, sovereignty and will never compromise in any security matter. The Malaysian Armed Forces is ever ready to face any eventualities while upholding its responsibility entrusted to them as the shield of the nation. The Malaysian Armed Forces Sentiasa Bersepadu